My name is Ed Manzi. I'm chairman and CEO of Fidelity Bank, and I've been at the bank since 1997. Before that, I was the CEO at Shirley Cooperative Bank. Shirley Cooperative Bank and Fidelity Bank merged in 1998. So if I combine the two of those banks, I've been serving the families, individuals, and businesses of Central Massachusetts in this capacity for going on 28 years. The vision of Fidelity Bank is to become known as the most caring, trusted, and respected local choice for financial information, products, and services. I was asked, how do we keep this vision alive and well into the future? Well, the most important thing is hiring and retaining the most caring, talented people we can find. But one of the things that we focus on particularly is being an agile organization. The world is changing at such an accelerated pace. Technology, customer demands, competition. So to build an organization that can be agile and adapt quickly that's a big focus for all of our businesses, I'm sure of it. I have had the good fortune of having some tremendous mentors in my life, starting with my parents, my bosses from my first jobs. Throughout my career, I've had a lot of really good people to work for and learn from. My board members, it's really been a gift. And some of the things that I have taken with me that I still carry every day when I come to the office are build relationships before issues. The idea there is if you have trusting, meaningful relationships, dealing with all issues is much easier and productive. Uh, some, some sayings from my dad used to, used to say, plan your work and work your plan. Say what you mean and mean what you say. Simple but very effective advice. And one of my personal favorites, we've all heard, if there's an elephant in the room, hunt it. In fact, that's a sign on my boardroom wall. I like to add to that, make sure you hunt it when it's small, because in my experience, if you don't, it always gets bigger. Things I'm proud of in my life, really primarily are my family. I love the way they've grown and what they're becoming and the way they're contributing to the world. That's what I'm most proud of. And there is one other thing I'd like to share, and it is to ask people to look up the conscious capitalism movement. It is a movement that is exploding throughout the world, really. And I first found out about it probably eight, nine years ago when I read a book called Firms of Endearment. It's a great book. The essential meaning of this book and the conscious capitalism movement is if you do right by all your stakeholders, this is so, such common sense, treat your clients, your community, your employees, your vendors as partners in this enterprise, everyone will do better and your company will do better too and there's data in this book to prove it. Get involved with that, look it up. I know it's how most people run their business anyway, but it's really powerful stuff.